Hi, I'm Rosemary Jean Thompson, and welcome to UBC's Next Big Thing. Today, my guest is Dante Zanata. He is the head coach of the men's soccer team here at UBC's Okanagan campus. Welcome. Thank you. So, okay, my first question is, why is it sometimes called soccer and sometimes called football? The North Americans, they like the word soccer because they have the other sport, that weird ball that's kind of oblong shape. In the rest of the foot world, it is football, or, you know, different languages have their own namesake for it, but uh, I call it football, so let's use that term. Yes. Okay, now I'm really going to get confused, but soccer, we are, we are good at soccer. Tell me, how did the year go? The women's program had a great year meddling again in uh, the Pac West, and our program has taken strides forward again, and we'd uh, tied for a playoff position, lost out on a tiebreaker, Ooh. but you know, the teams that went off to nationals, we had good success events from during the year, so uh, you know, the, the program continues to evolve, and it's taken over the three years, it's uh, taken some good steps, and looking forward. Now, you've been here three years, as you were pointing yes. out. In yep. the, is this the fourth year? Going into the fourth year, okay. yes. So what have you seen as a way of progression and change amongst these young athletes? We've changed the culture in, involved in what, you know, what varsity sports is in, in the football world at uh, U, UBCO, and the recruitment of different type of players. In the past, we weren't getting players who played for the provincial teams or involved in National Training Center or even out of the White Caps residency, but now we are being looked at the same as mm. UBC uh, Vancouver or UVic and other big schools and as far as the soccer program. You know, Kelowna, is a, it's a great place to, to live throughout the, the late fall and play mm -hmm. soccer and, and people still love the education you get at UBC. So you're able to draw more experienced players, players that are serious about what they're doing and that's going to make a difference in, in how we perform. The first year here our soccer program wasn't uh, known as a destination but now we are getting you know those calls or when you go talk to a player there is an interest to come here and you know, not being you know, the door closed in your face as you know sometimes it was in the past. In the future what are you hoping you'll be able to accomplish? What do you need to work on to get these boys to where well, they need you know, to I mean, be? Our, our goal every year is, is to build a program that you know in the next short period of time competes for a national championship. Every year is building blocks into that. We're always looking to improve in every aspect of our play, and our coaches are always looking to improve also. You can be the best coach in the world, but if you don't have you know, the, the right athletes, it's, it's hard to compete in, in those aspects. And you know, taking the step up to CIS mm -hmm. is a step up. Uh, we, you know, we, last year we played a couple of CIS teams in preseason and lost to one and beat one. So you know, we know there is a step up in that level, but uh, it, it's you know, a training environment and, and the competition environment, which is uh, where we all want to get to. Star players this year. Who did, you, who did you see and who you're hoping will drive it next year? You know, I mean, the, our core of, of Manny Straith and Dylan Abbott and Austin Jones, uh, they've been here since I've gotten here. They've really adapted to a different philosophy in football. Mm -hmm. There's a gentleman by the name of Enzo Paul who's a first-year player who ended up, I think, le leading, uh, come second or third in the league scoring. But the whole group is good. Well, it sounds like it's bright for everyone concerned. Next year we can appreciate the soccer being in the CIS and see what they can deliver for us there in that we look organization. To it. Thanks for coming today, Dante. No problem. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Until next time, I'm Rosemary Jean Thompson. Make it a great week.